star of the Cinco de Mayo show. Of course, I'm talking about tacos. In this video, I'll mostly be showing you how to make keto-friendly taco shells, as most taco filler, meat, cheese, tomatoes, uh, salsa is keto-friendly already, and everybody pretty much knows how to make it. And with the uh, ingredients that go inside of a taco being so well-known, common, plentiful, and vast, and very can vary so much, uh, I'm not going to tell you how to make those. Just use your favorite taco seasoning and fill it. So grab a non-stick skillet and let's get to it. Heat a non-stick skillet on high. Once heated, reduce heat to a medium high and put a, a handful of full fat cheese down in the taco shell size circle into the skillet. Let the cheese fry until the bottom becomes brown and begins to kind of float in its own oil. You'll now be able to gently work your spatula under the cheese. Now flip and let cook for about 10 seconds. Here's where it gets tricky. You need to have some kind of wooden spoon or dowel suspended between two cups. Under that, you'll want to lay some paper towels to catch the oil for easy cleanup. Once your shell has been flipped for about 10 seconds, pick it up with a spatula and lay the shell over the spoon or dowel to create the taco shell shape. I like to put a paper towel in my hand and dab off the oil from the top as well as help shape the shell. Now once that cools for a few seconds, you can put it on a plate and load it with your filling. And I don't think I have to explain the next step. Also, right now, I'd like to invite you to join the Keto Playground on Facebook. The link's in the description. And I'll put the recipe to these in the description as well. Until then, thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter at BobbyDKeto. Happy single to my